from divine sister of the light, Kirsty Elizabeth. For those still intent on looking for a sign of cosmic forces have been exceedingly obvious in the direct aftermath of the equinox and the most significant power date of 32323. Not only are we treated to the beautiful visuals of the moon conjunct with Venus, announcing an auspicious time of flowing feminine energetics as a directive to those sensitive enough to feel such phenomena, but we also see the mega-statement in the move of the planet Pluto into Aquarius, last seen in this cosmic stance 225 years ago in 1798, and now settling in for a long haul, taking us to 2043. But in addition, we have a cosmic parade as the planets line up with the moon to form a pathway in the great cosmos, which astronomers describe as a rare arc of planetary alignment, and I call an anchoring of light bridges at points of great energetic significance. Added to all this, we have been aware of geomagnetic storms caused by emissions from our very active sun, which have produced a colorful display from the aurora borealis, or northern lights, being more vibrant and visible and geographically further reaching, of which many are showing rare pink or red in the curtains of light. These happenings are all very significant, but in my mind the showing of magenta is the most potently important to the sensitive community. Scientifically, the colors are caused by chemical reactions with particles such as oxygen, nitrogen, helium, and hydrogen emitted from the sun as they reach the atmosphere of the earth at cloud level. The science of color and light has always been significant in the interpretation of physical energies within spiritual communities. The showing of pinks, reds, and purples in the skies above us is worthy of contemplation by science and by spirituality. The magenta ray is a combination of the purple of the violet of the crown chakra and the red of the root chakra, meaning that it represents the ability for our energies to join for the respective head-to-tail linear of the chakra system to join together to become cyclic. Those who can perceive this vision are connected to their higher state of being in the light and are sitting in a new state of enlightened awareness. Angelically, pink is the color of Archangel Shamuel, who is associated with the bringing of love into any situation. You may remember that I have expressed how the angelic agenda for the empowerment of a conscious humanity involves three main spiritual working groups working together and a united connected vision. This is a benchmark in the coming together of separate spiritual agendas to merge on an energetic level to work harmoniously on a loving plan for healing and transformation across the globe. My guide first told me of this in 2001, calling it The Gathering. This will be a time of great creativity and innovation as we bring forward loving ways to move forward as a species and as a part of a living planet. As a result of this innovative collective process, it will be the purpose of the millions of earth angels who are currently incarnated and have been positioned in roles across the communities to work to bring these heartfelt agendas into reality and to create new priorities for change which will have a major impact on the lives of individuals. 2023 will be a powerful time of group working and synchronizing a pure vision that will bring many lightworkers together on one heartfelt mission. The intense purging and clearing of toxic energies across the equinox has cleared the way for clear channels of communication from guides and is made ready for pure-hearted connections. The magenta ray is the key holder for the codes for this great agenda. Outwardly, it represents the combined loving hearts of the many guides across multi-dimensions who are choosing to gather together in the higher realms to support us at this time. You have never been more protected, guided, or loved. Kirsty Elizabeth